After high school, everyone's expected to go to college. And um, college isn't for everybody right after high school. So I floundered for about a year and a half. And then um, I had a friend that had joined the Marine Corps. And he was like, I joined the Marine Corps, I got my life together, but you could never do it. Like, it's too hard for you. Okay. I left for boot camp on June 26, 2001, and I graduated September 21st, 2001. So 10 days after 9-11. My name is Heather Gagney. I'm the athletic trainer for women's basketball here at Penn State University. We landed in Kuwait, in January 2003. When we landed, we crossed the border into Iraq. The Marines are the first in and the last out, and I knew I had signed up for, for something bigger than myself and something that was going to change my life dramatically. The Marine Corps, they break you down and they build you up into an elite individual that teaches you that you can do anything that you put your mind to. Marines, not only are they there to um, secure a nation, but they're also there to help a nation. They're there to provide support and to help the civilians on the ground. One night I had this idea that what makes you happy? Athletics, being around this, you know, celebration, whether it's a win or a loss or anything like that. I made this promise to myself that if I made it back, I would become an athletic trainer. I just thought to myself, that's what's gonna make you happy. I think part of driving with any team is building relationships with them and getting to know them. Everyone comes from different backgrounds. You gotta get to know the person to understand how to work with them. And so building that trust makes anything that you do absolutely amazing because they know that you're all in. If you're all in, then they're all in. I motivate the women's basketball players by letting them know that they are privileged, that, that they are in the best place that they can be, that there are so many worst case scenarios that they could be at. You gotta check all your baggage, everything, and you gotta put the mission first. And the mission is win games. They are elite at what they do, and you need to bring that eliteness to them. So that's bringing the juice, that's bringing everything that you have and giving them all the tools that they need to be successful in their sport. And it's not only their sport, it's their life. My time overseas definitely helped me see a different light on life and understand that there's really bad places that you can be at, but there's really good places that you can be at. But you create your own destiny. You create your own happiness. And so being able to fight through bad situations, no matter what it is, and overcoming that, adapt and overcome any adversity is, is, is part of life. And having those tools, and that's something the Marine Corps taught me, was whether it's in wartime, whether it's in everyday life, you, you get those tools and the Marine Corps gives you those tools to, to be a, a better person and to serve the world and not just yourself.